Stimulus check news update. We have more up-to-date information concerning stimulus checks that are going to be hitting bank accounts. That is some very, very exciting news for millions of Americans. We also have some amazing information on giveaways that we're doing on this channel. Guys, this video is loaded with information. Stay tuned because you don't want to miss. Hey, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to another show where we keep you updated on everything that is happening in this country as well as do a ton of giveaways. Now we know that we went to Google, we searched, is the United States in a recession? And Google says, well, yes, yes we are. Many of you viewers on this channel said, yes, we're in a recession. It may not be like 2008, but this is just a little bit different, but we are in a recession. So what does that mean for the people on a fixed income? What does it mean for those that depend on a monthly check? So it really boils down to what is the government going to do for those that are getting a check every single month? Well, they've done a increase, a cost of living adjustment based off inflation and due to the high inflation that we had in June, and then it kind of went down little by little, we even down at 8.7%, which is kind of monumental because it's never been that high in years. So this additional increase will provide additional income for those on a fixed income, getting those monthly checks. You're gonna see a little more added to your check, but the biggest question is, is that enough? With inflation where it's at, do we truly believe that that amount, 8.7% increase, matches the inflation that we're dealing with on a daily basis? Guys, let me know down in the comments below because you viewers are the ones who are having to live with this income and let me know is it enough? Guys, we do a ton of giveaways on this video just to say thank you for your love and support. So this Saturday, we're giving away $100 to one lucky subscriber. All you have to do is hit that subscribe button and smash that like button. Guys, we do a ton and we wanna give back to you guys to say how much we appreciate everything that you do but right here is our channel page and if you want to get an additional giveaway then all you got to do is join our membership and you will get some additional perks but you'll also get a chance to get a $25 gift card to any one of these three restaurants Olive Garden, Cracker Barrel, Red Lobster, some amazing restaurants and you can just say that True Life covered the bill $25 will get you something really, really good at any one of these three restaurants. And that is for those that join our membership for $2.99. So guys, we have some amazing information for you today. Right here on the screen, Social Security COLA will ease the sting of inflation. The cost of living adjustment will be 8.7% next year, bringing relief to retirees and others who rely largely on payments. So I want to know from you viewers that live this thing every single day, will this increase truly help you out? Let us know down in the comments below. So guys, now on to the stimulus check information that you came for, the most up-to-date information that's out there. Let's dive on the screen. State stimulus checks in 2022, New York payments have started to help counter inflation, pandemic woes, and financial hardships. Some states are sending tax rebate stimulus checks or other payments to residents. New York stimulus checks are being sent to approximately 1.8 million people starting this week, according to the New York Department of Taxation and Finance. This is something that many people have been waiting on. These tax rebates for Empire State residents are just an example of the state payments being sent to ordinary Americans throughout this country this year. Massachusetts and South Carolina will begin issuing payments soon too. So for those in Massachusetts that's been asking, for those in South Carolina, guess what guys? Your stimulus checks 
are coming soon. California has been on the list and will continue to send out stimulus checks until the end of the year. Colorado has dived on the list and giving those cash back payments to their residents up to $750 for single filers, $1,500 for join, and they will continue to go out until the end of the year. Someone just asked about Connecticut and they said, when is Connecticut going to do something? Well, they're going to give $250 per child. This is more like a child tax credit up to three kiddos and those will be sent out later this year to millions of Americans. Delaware sending payments up until the middle of this month for $300 per eligible person. So you have a chance to receive a $300 check in Delaware that will continue to be sent out. Now Florida, the only thing Florida has done is provide a $450 child tax rebate to foster parents, those that are needing help with the kiddos. So unfortunately, there's nothing for residents, but we will continue to do the daily research to keep you guys updated. Georgia continues to send out stimulus checks until the end of the year, sending out $250 for single, $500 for joint, $375 for head of household. Hawaii will continue to send out checks and those paper checks are a little delayed but they will continue to be sent out by this month. Idaho in the same boat, $75 or 12% of your income tax will go to you, whichever one is greater, and these payments will continue until next year to get everybody paid. Illinois has been on the fence about how much they were giving and they have settled with $50 and then getting, going up to $300 with dependents. These started in September. However, it's expected to take several months before all the payments are delivered. And this is an issue that several states are running into because it's taking a little longer than expected to get these checks into your hands. So this is where they say, hey, be patient because checks are coming soon. Looking at Indiana, who's on the list, several people have been getting a $125 credit from Indiana and yet again, some haven't. And when it comes to the paper checks, there was a supply shortage. So they weren't able to send out the checks like they wanted, but do know that checks are on the way. Maine. Maine is going to send out 850 per person, 700 for joint, and those checks will continue to go out until the end of the year. Massachusetts, they haven't determined the amount yet, but they've estimated about 13% of the recipient's 2021 Massachusetts income tax liability. These payments are expected to begin in November. So the biggest thing about the editors is they're trying to get out there and find an amount to give to the residents that aligns with their budget. And once they select that amount, those checks will be going out in November. Now, New Jersey has been more on the homeowner and the rental program assistance, giving them on average a $450 as long as they met the eligible requirements. Nothing yet for residents and nothing yet for child tax credits. It's more based on homeowners and those that own or rent, okay? Moving on to New Mexico. Now, New Mexico sent out three payments, different amounts, but many people have already received them and if you haven't it may be a check that didn't have any bank information but they mailed it out to you because they had your address so let us know down in the comments if you live in New Mexico my home state shout out to all those in New Mexico and my neighbors there in Kentucky love you guys thank you so much for watching Michelle I appreciate you thank you for your love and support and to all those who have joined our membership it's only two dollars and 99 cents but it helps us bring this news so guys thank you from the bottom of my heart i love you guys new york so new york we read this already that they are sending out these checks to millions of people and they're going out this week so looking for those in new york keep an eye on that now oregon people ask today is Oregon on the list? So this is what Oregon says. They're sending out a one-time payment to low-income or Oregon's who claim the state earned income tax credit on their 2020 taxes. Now, those who filed by December 31st 
are expected to receive a $600 check by the end of this year. So that is a deadline, okay, that you had to have done in order to get this check. Pennsylvania, who's eligible? Well, they've just like New Jersey, have fallen into a homeowner and a rental program rebate, giving people literally up to $250 to $650, just to kind of depending on the income bracket and where they fall and the eligibility. That's the only thing right now that's going on for the state of Pennsylvania, but I promise to continue to keep searching for more news. Rhode Island, well, who's eligible? Rhode Island has taken a Florida reproach based on sending out child tax credits. And this is where they've given $250 per child, up to $750 per household, up to three kiddos. Got to be under the 18, uh, got to be 18 years or younger. These checks will be issued out on a rolling basis throughout the end of the year. So if you haven't gotten it yet, the state will start mailing checks in December 2022. So in two more months, Rhode Island will be sending out those child tax credits. Now here's another state that many people have asked about, which is South Carolina. They are definitely sending out checks worth up to $800, which is truly amazing. But what I found out about South Carolina is that they will continue this check disbursement until next year. They want to get everybody taken care of. They want to get everybody paid and it's just taking a little bit longer. To finish this up today, Virginia is sending out checks very, very soon. They are giving out up to 250 for single filers, 500 for join, and the state is sending these payments out this month. This is what they said. The sooner you file, the sooner you get your check. Now remember, it may take a few weeks for you to get it, but at least it's on the way. They're gonna try to get everybody paid by November 1st, so they've only got a couple more weeks, so that way you can receive your stimulus check. Guys, that is all the states that are on the list. I promise to continue to research for Texas, Louisiana, Oklahoma, Utah, Michigan, Ohio has been a big, big one that everybody's asked for. North Carolina, South Carolina, Carolina, we just read. We want to know about Utah. There's Arizona. Guys, the list goes on and on, but I promise to do the research so you guys don't have to. We will continue to do daily, daily research on every state that is sending out stimulus checks. That's our job commitment to you to let you know what is going on in this country. Guys, I want to thank you so much for watching. Don't forget about all the giveaways that we're doing on this channel. And all you got to do is hit that subscribe button and smash that like button to get in on the $100 prize. Join our membership for the food gift card. Guys, there's so much that we're giving away just to say thank you and we love you. Well, guys, until next time, I'm John Miro. Peace.